Well, an emotional day for many as this weekend marks 75 years since the B-17 crash on Mount Tom and Holyoke, killing 25 servicemen. Western Mass News reporter Kaylee Puglis joins us in Springfield with more on how the community is coming together to remember those lives lost. Kaylee? Well, Kayla, many people gathered at the crash site on Mount Tom earlier this morning to commemorate those lives that were lost. On July 9th, 1946, around 1020 p.m., a devastating incident took place. While circling the area, preparing to land home after serving in World War II, the aircraft approached the Holyoke Mountain and without warning slammed into part of the rock at Mount Tom, about 900 feet high. Now, 75 years later, dozens gathered at the site of the crash Saturday morning to remember those lives lost. When you're on your way home, in many respects, that's when you let your guard down. Mm -hmm. You're happy. You're thinking of your family. You're thinking of your loved ones. Western Mass News spoke with the woman whose father was on the plane. Unfortunately, I never got to know him other than through stories. Helen Swan says when the crash happened, her brother was only a year old and her mother was pregnant with her. She says it wasn't until years later that she learned about what happened. A monument was placed at the site 50 years later after the crash, inscribing the names of the servicemen who were killed. It is beautiful and uh, I'm excited. To Swan now getting a chance to see the monument for the very first time. I thought 75th anniversary would be an excellent first time to come. Those who gathered at the memorial earlier this morning saying that being there to commemorate all of those lives that were lost during this tragic crash was an honor. Reporting in Springfield, Kaylee Puglis, Western Mass News.